Hello! I am back. That was the most weird hello ever. Hello, I have two special guests. Hi! I have Lucy and Lydia with me. Say hello. Hi! Hi. They literally Hi. just said hello. Can you say hello again? God, I'm so oh. demanding on my channel. No, no. Um, so we were thinking for ages. We've, we've been friends for a long time, but we've yeah. never filmed together. Um, and then I was like, let's just film. So yeah! We're here. In our house. I know. I been... love it because we always, when we always see each other, we're like, Next time we're together, we're we'll gonna film. film. And then we always just end up just hanging out and then we're like, next time we're gonna film. So we've moved, so we thought the perfect time yeah. to film. Yeah. But the thing is, we've been saying, literally, oh, for, for so long, should we film? And we're like, what should we film about? I was like, shall we just talk about Justin Bieber? <laughs> oh, <laughs> because we all love Justin Bieber. Yeah. No, so my idea for a video, and I hope you guys like this one, is basically a desert island chat video. So we're gonna talk to you about we're gonna talk like what we do on a desert island. Yeah. Do we even want to on a desert island? And we're also gonna tell you about our essential items. So you're gonna basically find out like what we could not live without. Yes. How so, would we survive on a desert I island? I don't know. Yeah. Like, I don't what would we actually do? Would you want to go on a desert island? Um, and you a day. No, no <laughs> hotel. No food. Like literally uh, shipwrecked. Nothing. For a no. day. It's crazy, isn't it? Experiences. Because in the Maldives, like you are literally on a desert yeah. island, but it's all built up. At some points, I was quite scared because I was like, "You are literally in the middle of the Indian Ocean. Yeah, if yeah. a shark just wants to come and get rid of your hotel, like it could. It is quite scary. Yeah. You're in the wilderness, and like a tsunami could come. That scared me. I was like, yeah. Tsunami oh, hurts. Yeah. yeah. You just don't know. Like the world. The thing is, nature always wins. Like no matter yeah. what we build and what we do, nature always wins. God, it sounds yeah. so deep, but, but it's, it's true. so true. And like I was swimming, and there were actually sharks and stuff. And when you see, I watched a TV program, I think it was on BBC for charity, yeah, right? and they put loads of celebrities on an island and they had to actually like kill animals to eat. Real, and really that, that, like, yeah. not a chance. I would not no. do that. And then to get water, they have to like suck it out of trees and do like really, it's crazy. God. So it doesn't oh, I can't even rest. build my own bed and furniture, so <laughs> I would be useless on an island. I don't even be able to build anything. If I can't put bed and furniture yeah. together, I don't know. I always thought like on I'm a Celebrity they say oh you can take like three items from home and I'm like what would I take and those they take like a picture of their kids we don't have to do that so at least we don't have to waste an item on that. Um, <laughs> A picture of my dog. So uh, I'm going to show you the things that like yeah we take. So what yeah. would you take? Okay so the first thing that I would take is... You did shampoo him! Yeah because... But you're in the ocean. I know but I honestly can't live without this. I know like, you know, it's all about like beachy hair. Well, priorities, at least your hair would look good while you're running to try and get some food so you don't die. Exactly, <laughs> but honestly, I would, obviously, my hair would be beachy. That's so funny. It'd be beachy, but it would also not be green. green and not knotty. That is so And the colour, my hair wouldn't go green. Because <laughs> I'm on holiday, because my hair, yeah, yeah, but chlorine hair. makes it green. You know if you wash oh. it with tomato ketchup, it gets rid of the chlorine, it gets rid of the green. Oh. My hair used to go green and I washed with, it. it's like, Opposite each other on the colour scale. Um, and what, like, what is the experience like? <laughs> no, 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 it's not nice. It gets rid of the green, so if you ever get green hair, and use ketchup. Like, yeah, I mean, I'd wash my hair in the ocean with this, oh, and I'd be like, would. Beach, like in the ocean on this desert island where everyone's dying of no food and I'd be washing my water, and she's just like, oh, at least my hair. Um, like, actually, if I run out of this, I refuse to wash my hair. See, I love Red Ken. Red Ken, the, um, the ones in the blue bottle, is my oh, favourite. Yeah. 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 Like, Red Ken is just the best brand. Yeah. So I couldn't live without my Red Ken Blonde Idol shampoo. <laughs> or the condition, the mask. We haven't actually got any at the moment, which we need, but the mask is like so My good. hair is so knotty if, I, if it was just beachy. Like, after yeah, a while, imagine then, yeah. after a while, like, maybe oh, like, Even when Matt like, puts his hands in my hair, I'm like, stop it, you're literally knocked in my hair. Yeah. You know yeah. like, when you've been to the beach and like, Imagine being there for two weeks and it just being beachy, beachy, yeah. beach, beachy. Beach. Because it's, it's not. The yeah. wind and the sand ruins your hair. No, okay, so maybe you've got quite a good point. Thank you. Yeah. I won't bully you too much. <laughs> See, now I'm going to hold up my product and I'm thinking actually probably that would be better than what I've got. Why would you need dry shampoo oh on my this God. island? Because you just wash your hair every single time it got greasy because you're on the ocean and it's dry like that. <laughs> <laughs> we're, not, we're not cut out to be on uh, the ocean. Yeah, but, well, uh, yeah, good point. But I honestly, I can't live without a dry shampoo. I can't. It makes your colour look better. I actually use it to make my colour look a bit better. True, like once your roots start coming free. Like, yeah, light and that yeah. Touch yeah. But, oh, just, well, especially the tropical one, I thought, you know, desert island. <laughs> but, no, I just love dry shampoo. Like, sometimes you can't be bothered to wash your hair. And you just like. It makes your hair all big and. It nice. will make your hair look good. You won't need any other styling products. But it's not like you're going to be going out on a night. You're but literally... what if you want to, you know, look good on a beach? What if you fall in love with the exactly. guy who happens to come over in a shirt? Exactly, you need dry shampoo to make your hair look good. So, no. No, but I honestly think dry shampoo is just... Oh, it is good. Oh, I love and it. also, I think this dry shampoo is just such a good brand. I mean, yeah. I know they've tried to bring out fancy ones and they are good, 
But for me, I actually, I don't like it when dry shampoo brands bring out the ones that don't have the white, because I want the white, so it makes my yeah, hair look. Yeah, true, but then it's because we're blonde. Yeah. <laughs> See, we like that. Yeah. But imagine being a brunette, how hard Yeah, I remember like, yeah. I was in Matt's hair once, and Matt was like, I look like I've got dandruff, and I'm like, embrace it. <laughs> keep going, keep yeah. going. Yeah, so I would say dry shampoo all the way. While we're on the topic of hair, well, if we went on an island together, oh. we'd be sorted. Look how much hair's in this. Oh my god. This is my hairbrush, and you guys will have seen me mention this loads. It's the best hairbrush in the world. It's the Tangle Tamer Ultra. Oh. And it's just, I don't like the tangle teasers that you've got to hold like this. I can't grip them properly. Right, right. But this, you it's, press up it's the same exact thing. Oh, with so the handle. I really like a tangle teaser. But this is just perfect. So when you're on an island, it actually yeah. will, like you said, you can't go two weeks without doing anything to your hair. You get dreadlocks. So you. This is great. Did so our hairbrush. So I'll together, if we all went together. Yeah. <laughs> Ta da, we'd have the best hair on the island. <laughs> would. Not that anyone would see us. Yeah, I know. So that's mine. What have you got next? Um, no, I've, I've oh my God. God. now I think you actually what's the point. Maybe if I did have my phone and I wanted Instagrams, <laughs> I would use the Vita. Goes without saying that we'd all take our phones, <laughs> but we wouldn't have any Wi Fi. I would take PG. my phone, I'll just use the video, so that'd be one. Okay, but, okay, we'll take one phone between us, but if I'm taking Instagrams on a beach and I want my skin to look good, I'd use the Vita. That's so <laughs> Honestly, it's so good. See, I prefer to use like oils. Um, Sandra Bay do the most amazing bronzed oil, Ooh. and it comes out like, oh my god, it's amazing. But I um have lots of like bruises on my legs. Oh, and it covers them. Yeah, yeah. It's oh, really, it's really amazing. good. Like yeah. covering like scars and bruises, and it's like airbrush for your legs. Oh my god. And it gives colour. And also, I don't tan. I mean, I would if I was there for a long time. Yeah. But you I don't, don't want to burn. burn. This makes you look brown. Just so you know, we take some time cream because yeah. we are yeah. three British girls. <laughs> if we were to on island, like. I, more to the point, I'd be scared of burning, getting skin cancer. Like, I cannot, I'm so petrified of being laid on an island with nothing on my skin. I'd be I under know. a tree all the time, like, so, unless I'm Oh no, even, on. even if I was on the island, I don't sit out and sunbathe. I sit in the shade the whole time. Yeah, yeah honestly, I'm, 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 okay, I'm, I'm, I'm not a. I sunbathe. Because I can't. I burn too much. But in recent years, though, I have genuinely thing. got really concerned about yeah. like, how bad it is for my yeah. skin, so I do try to limit it, and I'm like, no, I'll just wear fake tan. In my turn, okay, yeah. this is a really practical one. Very boring. <laughs> so I'm gonna do two in one. Okay. I take contact lenses because I'm blind. Literally, <laughs> I would not be able to see if I was dropped on an island. You I would literally like if I went on I'm a celebrity. Would they let me take contact lenses? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Well, I just don't. Would know you ever do something like that? No. <laughs> would you? No. Well, I actually I think I'm a celebrity. I don't even like camping. <laughs> well, I think I'm a celebrity is like the least tacky reality TV show. And I actually yeah. really enjoy it. Oh, I love it. It's probably one of my favourites. If I was actually a celebrity, no, I probably would go on because I am a fan of it. be quite good. I, I like the idea good. of doing everything. But if they made me jump out of a plane, I couldn't get into the island in the first place because I have a phobia. Maybe. So I need to do like a different challenge to get yeah, onto the yeah. island. Um, but I like, I do like the idea because I love being on like islands, and I do think they do bring me food. It's a bit fixed, isn't it? They're yeah, not like if they don't leave you. Though. Yeah. But if they look, let me talk, take contact lenses, definitely. And then on, while we're on the thing of eyes, I'd have to take a mascara because I actually prefer my face when I'm like got a natural tan and my face is tan. I don't need makeup. Yeah. And then the sun kind of gets rid of your impurities anyway. Yeah. But Victoria gets really annoyed at me because. When we were in Greece, I, I was like, mm, I've got loads of spots, I'm just going to go in the sun. She was like, ah, don't do that. She was like, no. She's like, I, I call her mum a fro. I call her that because she gets so angry at me when my body burns. And I totally get it, but it was accidental. But um, isn't it amazing? Like, you know when you've been on the like, skin oh, top looks top so hands. good. Like, yeah. Like, that's what I mean. It's flawless. It goes within like a day. And it's obviously not good for your skin. There are like long-term effects. Yeah. but. Come on, that like instant glow that you get when you've been out in the sun even for one day. I sit at dinner that night and I'm like, oh, I feel like a goddess. <laughs> yeah. So I'd pack a mascara so that, you know, if we did have a nice dinner while we're on this <laughs> desert island, and this is the best mascara in the Which world. One is that? It's Clarins that? Supra Mascara, Ooh. Supra Volume. Ooh, can I, look I did a blog post about all my favourite mascaras, which I'll link that below. Is. And this is it's like amazing. Brushing. It's actually really dry now. I need a new one. I've got it on now and it's really not as good anymore. I was gonna say your eyelash is really curly. Absolutely amazing. I just wish it wasn't as dry. It's been far too well used. Oh, Lucy, I would need to take a moisturiser. Yeah, no, that's I great. Would, I'd be stealing that. Well, well, it's only a small one. You could <laughs> actually get. We could get like a big tub of one. I have this. I got it from oh. World Duty Free, and like so that you can use it on the plane. It's like a little set. Yeah. Honestly, this moisturiser is so nice. <laughs> like 
it makes my skin feel so really hydrated. so hydrating like this would be perfect for a desert island because it is like so hydrating and i always use this before i go on a plane yeah, like, yeah on the yeah. plane like oh it's just so, I, I use so like a face mask I so <laughs> yeah. yeah i use an origins face mask so oh we could take plane oh. because our oh, desert island i use an origins face mask it's like a mask that you sleep in yeah and then i use stuff this like that this is so nice but clinique is just amazing skincare yeah, it's one of my really favorite good. brands ever really really good and it just it doesn't like irritate my skin in any way and it's just it's just the nicest moisturizer to use especially when your skin is feeling really dry and yeah. like dehydrated it's a really it's nice really size to take on a plane actually. so good i think that's why they sell it in this set i World think this Duty is like Free. a travel size yeah, yeah. World Duty Free do like a thing and it's like a set where you get oh, a few just, of them because i used to actually work for clinique and oh, um, before I I it. and i would always talk to people about that moisturizer because i love it, it even makes I know we're not make, wearing makeup on this uh, desert island. No, but it moisturizer. Really nice. And it also makes your tan last longer and it means yeah. that your skin's not going to flake. And exactly. also, the sun is, it sucks everything out of your skin. You do really need to moisturize. Yeah. I find it hard to moisturize in winter because I'm so cold and in summer, I really oh, love to moisturize. Yeah. And I find I, when I tan, I do get quite peely, especially yeah. around my oh, nose. Yeah. Always around my nose. So this the is. The sun's just not saying. actually very good for you. No. We all love it. It's not. It's good yeah. in small doses. Yes. Yeah. It's kind of like pizza. <laughs> My last essential that I take on a desert island are Ray Ban sunglasses. I have some as well. Do you have? I love. Oh gosh! Ray-Ban anyone would think that you were twins. <laughs> 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 anyone would think that you were twins. Oh, we amazing. love these. I love the style. I love the colours. I we have these ones in black. It's the best style ever. Yeah. It's the best yeah. style ever. I think I got the black ones because of you, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I saw them on Instagram. I think that's why I actually got them. <laughs> they are just the most perfect. I think we were related in another life. So we always joke. And we love Ray Ban Yeah. I was reading your YouTube comments. Yes. <laughs> and so many people on YouTube were commenting about like Mary Kate and Ashley, and I was like, I was literally obsessed. Like, this is how we bonded because we all knew the Hilary Duff song. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So these are the sunglasses. We wear these in every Instagram picture. It. And also, on a desert island, you're going to need sunglasses. So I'd recommend these ones. You know, when you go on a holiday and the sun, like, you wake up in the morning, you go to go have breakfast, and the sun is like, like so dry. It's so bright. So I would definitely also, say sunglasses. Also, it covers up not having makeup on. Like, you can look absolutely flawless. Horrible in the sunglasses. Sunglasses. And you look But amazing. on a holiday, well, when we go on holiday, we can, like, take them. Yeah, yeah. 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 an amazing trip. If there's anywhere that you think we should all go together that's, like, really sunny and amazing, yeah. leave a comment below because I'd love to know we're going to do, like, a triplet road trip. Yeah. <laughs> It's going to be so good. What's your last product? Uh, so my last product is Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Concentrate. Similar to the fact that we take moisturiser. <laughs> my skincare item. Um, this is my favourite product ever. Everyone knows. I've done a full video about Kiehl's, so I'll leave that below. Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Oil. I use it every single night. And Never tried it. Never tried it's it. a replenishing exila of pure essential oils. And it's basically, I put two little drops of it on my skin every single night. Sometimes I put moisturiser over, but it depends how well it sinks into my skin. Yeah. And it just makes your skin look flawless. It kind of fakes like eight hours sleep. It's completely natural. And I feel like it is so good for when your skin's been hit by the sun. It's kind of like a moisturiser, oil, yeah. and skin fixer, three in one. You've completely sold that so to me. So it's perfect for when you're on a beach. Because I used to use a Guerlain, oh, what was it called? Guerlain's Midnight amazing. Secret. Oh, oh that's so like that. Nice. Wow. Wow. The best thing about this, I was thinking on a desert island as well, you could probably even like use it on your lip, use it on your body. Yeah. You could literally, you could probably use it on your hair. Like, you yeah. know if you're on an island and you're a bit like, I need to replenish everything, hydrate everything. It's natural, so it's not going to make you break out. It's just perfect. I have like travel size ones. I have one at Matt's, one at my mum's <laughs> house, one in my bag at all times because yeah. I use this every single night. I I've been using it for about five years. Yeah. Wow. I'll have to give you a little bit to try. I would love it. But also, obviously, on a desert island, we would need. Water, obviously, yeah. Food, like obviously, we need these. Who would be out catching the fish? Because it wouldn't be me. Yeah, that. please don't think that like we're just. Obviously, we love beauty, yes. but we do actually know that we need serious things. This is more of a joke, yeah. Today, but I don't know who'd be out catching the food because I could not go out and do that. No, I could. Funny story. It's really weird. Like I say, if I were on a boat. <laughs> I couldn't jump off the boat into the ocean. Oh, you see, I can do that, but I do have a bit of a fear of sharks. I am, it's really weird. I can swim in the sea, but if, but I am kind of scared of the ocean at the same time. I the ocean is scary when yeah. you're in the middle of it, and it's that dark ocean, it suddenly gets really cold under you, and you oh, know that you are literally in the middle of, like, for example, in the Maldives, I was in the middle of the Indian Ocean. Yeah. It went really cold, I looked around, there was just ocean, I'm a bit like, 
this is petrifying. Yeah. It's beautiful, but when you're in it, it's not so beautiful almost. It's scary, isn't it? So I would be out catching the fish. I don't know who would. I think we'd starve because I just we'd couldn't have, do that. We'd have, one of us would have to take the tea. It would be really, like, we'd have to just eat plants or sand because what would we do? No, I, I, like, I like fish. I do, but could you get one? No. 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 We'd have to hope it would be like I'm actually very particular with fish, though. I like, am like fish, meaty fish, not fishy fish. <laughs> I, I don't like sushi. Fish. <gasps> I love, see, I love sushi. Really? I love sushi. No. I'll try, you've never tried sushi. I can say that I don't like sushi, and I have tried. I it. like calamari. I like oh, tuna. I, I yeah. like tuna steak. Oh, I, don't I like, like fish and chips. I like tuna. Tuna steak. Fish and, and chips. Oh, oh scampi. <laughs> With tartar sauce. Fish fillets from McDonald's. <laughs> we keep talking about McDonald's. <laughs> I know. I don't know what you'd take on a desert island. So make sure you leave a comment and let me know because I'm genuinely really interested. Like, what would you actually yeah. take on a island? Like, I picked really materialistic things. It was really like shampoo. Would I really need shampoo? Yes. It was re It was actually I like really hard. Difficult. Especially like, because actually, all of these things, you don't really need. <laughs> I know though, if you could only, if they told you, so you're going yeah. on this desert island, but you can only take one person, who would you take? You'd, you'd take I'd take Lucy. Lydia. Yeah, I would take Actually, Lucy. let me think this through. If I couldn't take Lucy, My I mom. would take Jeff or my mom. Um, who would you yeah. take? See, I'd take Matt because Matt, would be so good at survival. Yeah. Like, I know Okay, he's... Matt, you're coming with us. <laughs> yes, we can't get the fish. So you can I just, get the fish. I know that he's like, he's got that like male instinct and he genuinely is like. I mean, if I had a boyfriend, maybe I would take my boyfriend. No, because then it's not fair. Like, I feel like you have to be together. Oh. Yeah. We'll just have to take each other, won't we? Yeah. yeah. Also, we take our phones as well. Yeah, so that will be my friend. <laughs> yeah. But we wouldn't have any internet. Oh, actually, what would be the point? Oh, photos if you want to it. For afterwards. So you have to leave me a comment, let me know who you'd take, let me know who you wouldn't take. <laughs> who wouldn't you want to be stuck on an island with? Ooh. Spiders. Uh, oh, I would reveal. Snakes. Oh, I'm like snakes. really scared of snakes, I don't know why. Yeah, See, well, guys, I see any kind of flying bird. <laughs> I saw a snake in Sri Lanka and it slithered past me and it was the most petrifying Do you know thing. what, you should never say your worst fears, because it might actually not be good for you one day. I don't know. Like, Everyone knows I'm afraid of pigeons and seagulls and stuff. I'm just gonna get a pigeon and like throw it at you. Here you go. Happy New Year's Day. Thank you so much for watching, guys. It was a pleasure to have Thank my lovely you. ladies on my channel. If you want more of them on my channel and you've got any ideas of what we should film, yeah, locations we need to visit, leave me a comment below. I'm gonna leave all their details below. You're gonna follow them on Instagram. Instagrams are like literally. You'll just see me comment and like, you know, be like, first honestly, comment. I was super always like, oh my god, yes, hi, hi, hi. hi. No, because honestly, like, also, makeup looks amazing, everything, oh, and I leave their channel below, everything, tweets, everything, you've got to follow them. I mean, I think we were, like, related in another life, I think we so. were. Maybe it's because we're the same age. Yeah, I think we just have so much in common. We just have so common. much in common, like, And we were, like, amazing. the same era, so, like, we liked the same things growing yeah. up. Yeah. Hilary Duff. If you guys liked Hilary Duff oh. or Mary-Kate and Ashley, I was obsessed. Please let they me know They were, like, my... Three. I was gonna say my two. My three. Like See, this is how idols. much we talk. Yeah. And we love Justin Bieber too, don't we? And we love Justin Bieber. <laughs> so this is how much we talk. So if you want more of this, let me know. We'd love to make this more of a regular Yeah, occurrence. definitely. Make sure you sub. And also there's a video of me on their channel too. Yes. Yes. So I'll leave that below. And I will see you all later. Bye. Bye.